Thank you so much for joining me as Game Edge. We're back in Hydroneer with a brand new spanking update 1.2 prior to the update, uh, well, the release on May 8th, which will be on Steam. You can put the, will be a link in the description field down below. What you can do is just hop on there and put in a wish list. A very, very cool looking game and a very cool developer so far. I've been really enjoying it. Uh, there's some brand new stuff that's been added to this uh, right now. There's a new, well, 20 new features total. Fancy new uh, furniture and lots of new machinery. Uh, massive optimization, cleaning up the issues of FPS, which has been uh, some people have been having issues with. Uh, new world locations like scrap yard and uh, unwanted parts into scrap to sell, so we can put that in there. And uh, he did recommend a brand new game, so that's why we're back in a brand new thing. So this is really cool, new furniture objects. Uh, let's go and check out what we can find over here and uh, see if there's anything cool on this side here. Now, uh, all right, probably not on this side. We're going to have to go and travel time. Oh, what's this? Grinding wheel. Nice. Okay, so we can get ourselves a grinding wheel now. That's a new one. We still have those lights. You have all this stuff here. Is that a glow stick? No, that's just a seam. <laughs> if you guys don't know anything about this, the game is fan friggin' fantastic. I, I had a lot of fun with it. I really did. And we can go around maybe to check out the town over there. I right, know at first, let's go up here and check out to see if there's anything new to this side. Yeah, this game is all about mining and getting yourself some gold and selling it off. But uh, the, it looks like the developer is uh, definitely adding more to this game than we expected. And you can sell stuff right here at the jewelry store. And uh, over here, I'm not sure if it's probably a little further out. So we're probably going to venture a tiny bit out to go and check it out and see what's there. Yeah, I don't think there's anything added to this one. So I'm going to go and take a nice little walk down the street and get ourselves there. I don't think it's a troll. Actually, we can try out the truck. And see if the truck is up to par now. So there's been little issues with the truck. Definitely a little issue. All right, let's do this. Oh, that's what we're going to start off with there. We're going to start off that because we have no cash. The truck seems a lot more stable. As we're driving this right now, it seems a lot more stable. I don't know if it's just me or I'm feeling it. Oh, yeah, it looks good so far. It looks pretty darn good. Okay, we should probably should look at the map. Do we have one right there, I believe, when we first start? Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> okay, there's a town. Oh my god. Turn. Oh, this is much better. The truck is so much better at handling. And we don't have any kind of like uh, weird flops in the air so far. Very, very nice. All right, so this is the main town. Oh, there we go. Woo! Stop. Okay, the brakes on this thing are going to need some work for me. <laughs> I have to get, jump out of it, I think. Okay. Oh no. No. Not again. It hit so good. You flip back over. Awesome. All right, what's this? Fancy furniture. Very, very nice. I'm liking this. All right, so we got ourselves some fancy tables and stuff. We can build, of course, yourself a base if you want to. Uh, there's a throne. Awesome. Some deer trophies. Golden head statues. Ooh, a safe to store your gold and bars and stuff to keep it all nice and safe. I like that. I wonder if he's going to bring in some pirates and stuff. Uh, fish trophies, and we got some plank to show off your gems. And Ooh, nice. I like that. And uh, this is where you're going to buy this stuff. Very, very cool. Nice new objects. Uh, I think there's a rug there, too. You can put some fancy carpeting. I'm liking that. We're going to check out to see in this one what we have new here. This stuff is all pretty much... What's this? Funnel. I don't remember that. That's brand new. A whole bunch of tools and stuff for us to play with. There's a map right here which we can purchase. 45 buckaroos. I'm not positive we don't have one already. A saw. All right, that's brand new, too. I don't remember that at all. There's a magnet here. I think we got that last time. Oh, wait. This is just what? A magnet staff. This is not the machine. Now, did you take that out? I wonder if you removed the backpack. I, I think the backpack was an issue. And yeah, I think he removed it. We also have a scale over here now, too. And again, a grindstone is still there. Very nice. Very nice. As we saw in the other merchant area. Now, this is another one over here. Okay. We got fishing pots. Fishing, of course, we got all fishing stuff we need. We also have ourselves some walls here and some roofs, which are great for the mines. We're going to need those. Ooh, large foundations. Ooh, 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 ooh. How much are those? 40 buckaroos, not bad. Large wall doorway. Already pre-built, ready to go. Some more walls, some more stuff. I like the way this is looking right now. A lot of different things for us to go and build with. And of course, those light posts are fantastic. We're going to need one of these beds. We're going to get that from our other place. Uh, there's something else here. Was that the jewelry store is here? Okay. The trucks are here. Oh yeah, our two big trucks. We did tr test them all out, and again, the last time we would kind of jump in in there and test it out completely. And again, there's a dragon right there. Can we open this door? No. It'd be kind of cool if we can just open a door and walk right in. 
Yeah, I'm liking that. Alright, let's go and check out the scrap area here. This is where we were just talking about two seconds ago. Alright, so I guess we just drop it here. Interesting. This is going to be for future stuff here too, but yeah, I guess we're going to drop our stuff in here. And then they'll tell us how much it's how much we can scrap it for. I guess we'll have to test it out sooner or later. That will be very, very cool. I can't wait to do it. New fishing objects too. Gems uh, now spawn as... Oh, uncut. Ooh, we got to cut them. There we go. Very, very cool. Scrap yard. Very nice. All right, I'm going to drive back and we're going to start working. And uh, we'll get ourselves a bed too so we can sleep the night so we don't get stuck with it. Again, I want to test out this truck a tiny bit. Taking corners. Woo. Yeah, let go of the gas. That turns sweet. Love it. Yeah, a lot more stable. This is a lot more stable than it was before. Very, very nice. Good job, Dev. Whoa. Okay, slow. <laughs> that that was close, dude. I thought it was going to pause it, but I, I, we had to test out the truck, man. We had to test this out. This is a whole lot better. Now, to fuel up this truck, you got to use the small buckets on top. Oh, damn. Well, thankfully enough, there's no damage. <laughs> we have to fuel this baby up on the top. You can see it there. We can throw in a bucket. I wonder if that was kind of fixed up. There is another town right over here. And over here, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have to show you guys this. Cue to get out. Now, oh, did I? Oh, right there. <laughs> right here. Now, if you walk in here, we can find some special places in each plot for them, I believe. And we place them down in here. I'm not sure what happens at the end of it, but that is very nice, too. But uh, with all the added features we have now, we have a lot to go through. There's also a tower there. I'm not sure if that... I think that was there before. There's a cemetery to the right. That's right. Yes, it is. Very nice. And there is another town right to the right over here. I'm not sure if he added anything to this area down here. Now, there was a merchant. There you go. There's a merchant there. We can sell from this. It's actually pretty close to our base. It's actually closer than the other places up the thing, I think. Well, maybe it's about the same. Then they're going to the village. I don't know. It's your choice. And yeah, okay. So yeah, there's no jewelry store in this one. That's what it is, right? Yeah. Okay. There is a well, though. We used to drop it down. Got a golden boot last time. Very nice. I'm sure there's a plot for us to build in here. I don't think so. It's all like beaver dammed and stuff. <laughs> it's so nice. I like it how developers are running with this. This is very cool. All right, let's start up our, our enterprise for today. And again, if you guys want to see more of this, you're going to hit the like button and get calm fields. Just want to show you guys a little bit around and see what was what. So that way we can see it, especially if you guys seen the previous ones. It is a lot of fun. And that the dev is working on this is even better. It's so freaking awesome. Can't wait for May, May to see how well this does. I'm, I think it's going to do extremely well. This game is going to be a lot of good time to go pass some time over. Um, you know what? I, I think I'll just bring my truck like this. I'm going to fill her up. I don't think... How much money do I have? I don't even know how much coin I have, to tell you the truth. Do I have any coin at all? Okay, let's turn her around a little bit. That should be good enough for us to get ourselves out and about. Yeah, a truck is a lot more stable. We used to hit things like this and go flying in like a split second. Very nice. Okay, well, I, I don't think I have any coins. <laughs> I'm thinking about it. I think we're going to have to start with what's given to us. And uh, we have a light. That's always nice. You left click and turn that on. There's our map, by the way, if you guys are looking for it. Okay. Uh, there's our brush and stuff. So I guess we'll just do the rustic start to this. Yep, it's going to have to be rustic for sure. We'll go get her a shovel on the left side right here. There we go. We'll get that going. We have a brush ready. We do. Nice, nice. Okay, so we'll go and dig, and it'll start off a little bit less than usual. Oh, I think, yeah, that's okay. Can I throw more in there? No. I don't know if I can drop that clump in there. All right, I know you can do a couple of digs in this and then drop it down. Uh, we'll start off with this little uh, packet of crap. I just did. Beautiful. Drop you. Grab you. And start brushing. All right, we got ourselves a little bit of lead. All right, that's not great, but it's going to have to do. All right, we're going to grab this and make sure that little green spot's there and drop that sucker in there. Again, we're going to pick up. Boom. And we'll get this automated, too. You can get this all automated. It's so much fun. Okay, boy, I, is that just lead I'm getting? Crap, dude, that's really not as good as I thought it would be. Okay. Not, not the best start. I, I also need a bed. So it's getting dark now. I need some money. We need some gold, dude. We need to get some serious amount of gold. Okay. All right. Let's let's do this. Come on. I just need a little bit of gold here. Just a little bit so I can get some sleeping time. 
Okay, we got a couple of nugs. Just a couple of nuggets there. Very nice. So that should do us pretty good. We'll get a couple more of these. I don't know if I should be the top layer is the reason. I mean, if I'm digging down the top layer, it's causing a little bit of an issue. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Okay, grab this bucket. Drop it in here. You can pretty much fill them up now. The more you dig deep, the better the stuff we get. So that's definitely something we have to work on. Okay, so yeah, a little more nuggets. That is good. We'll just get ourselves a little bit more here. Let's grab our bucket and put it in front of us. We don't have to turn around every two seconds. And uh, you know what? I'll grab my light here because it's getting bloody dark. Well, oh, okay. Well, we'll just do it like that. It's fine. One, two, three, and four. I just want enough to get some sleep so we can get a uh, bed. That's all I really want right now. So, you know, this should be pretty good. Not all really good ones, but that should be at least enough for us to do that. Okay, let, let's go and see what we can sell this off for. Uh, there's that place right here, but I'm, I'm going to go to the jewelry guy because I think I can get more bang for my buck. If I'm not mistaken, that's only for jewels and stuff we can do. It looks gorgeous, this game, though. Even at night, I love the lights. They are very nice. I just have to drop this bucket onto here, like so. And, yeah, we got 79 bucks, so that's going to give us at least a bed, dudes and duets. All right, drop that here, there. It actually took our iron, too. Interesting. I didn't think it would take my iron. It stole my iron, dude. Okay, well, it's not very much money to start off with. I'm not going to... Oh, we don't want to drop off there. But uh, it's going to do. It's going to give us something. <laughs> grab this. Drop that off in there. And then, uh, yeah, grab yourself a bed so you can get some sleep here, dude. Okay. Yeah, how much is that? 43 bucks. Sold with a left click. All right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take this and just put this down. And with the left click, it'll tell you where you can place this thing. For now, we can do this temporarily till we get something else. We're going to sleep till daylight comes. Thankfully enough, we don't have to feed yourself or anything. Uh, we do want to dig a little deeper and get more. But again, in darkness, it is a pain. And so let me jump into that portion of it with a little good night rest. All right, here we are. It's morning. It's a little dark, but it's, it's going to do for now. <laughs> it's going to do. We still have our nice trusty lamp, which is uh, does a pretty good job, but uh, I think the other ones do a better better job. Yeah, they think they do. All right, we can only put in one big scoop in there, so we're going to grab and go deeper in this one and try to get as much as we can on day one. This is our goal. I think it's... There we go. Beautiful. And daylight is coming, so don't worry. You'll be able to see a whole lot better in a few seconds from now. Drop you. Boom. Okay. Let's, uh, let's watch that. Oh, God. Really? One little nugget. That's all I got. All right, let's go in deeper. Oh, that was a bad shot, dude. Okay. In here. Okay. You know what? We'll do a double shot because at this point, I'm going to need a couple more buckets to make my day a whole lot better. But, I'm, yeah. Got to make it happen. Deeper we go, the better the resources are. So, yeah, that's that's where we want to go. The second scoop should be better, I think. I'm, I'm hoping better than what we just got. I'm gonna drop you back around. Grab you, wash. All right, that's, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. Drop you. Ooh, bigger nuggets. Bigger nugs. Bigger nugs, better life. And then uh, we'll sell them raw. Then we can put them into a nice little crucible and get that going. And really get ourselves some decent stuff. Now, the deeper we go, like I mentioned, the better off we are. So we want this to be all nice and full. Let's drop you. Daylight. Cool, man. I'm so freaking happy. Hey, I can see more than a foot in front of me. Also, I had a very kind gift sent to me, by the way, by Anonymous. I they don't want to tell <laughs> who it is. But yes, yeah, very nice gift. I had a, a brand new Samsung monitor sent to me. Yeah, I, I've been working on a very, very old monitor for a long period of time. And a, uh, yeah, very, very kind. Thank you. You know who you are. Thank you very much for that. Uh, boy, it makes a big difference. <laughs> I can see colors now. If I see things you guys didn't think I could see too much, my monitor was finished. It actually popped not too long ago. It broke. So, yeah, it's it was, it was a good monitor. It lasted for a long time. It was about uh, six years old, I think. At least seven maybe seven years old maybe even more than that so it, it did a good job I'm, you know, I'm not saying it didn't do a good job just not uh yeah not primo 
But my daughter's uh, definitely excited. She saw it. She went, oh, my God, it's so nice. In the... <laughs> it really was. It really was. So thank you. I know they didn't want me to mention it. So but thank you very, very much. Um, yeah, it makes a big difference. Definitely helps me out. I definitely could not afford that currently. Uh, that was on my wish list. Uh, so, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. All right, drop you. Drop. And, uh, ooh, that's good. Oh, if money was only this easy to make, wouldn't it be great? Like, if we sat down there and we had to go in our backyard or plot and just start digging away like this. Yeah, I'm going to have to go get some supper tonight. All right, well, uh, I'm going to go in the backyard and dig a couple buckets of gold. You know, that that would be primo right now, especially in today's situation. That, that would be, um, yeah, I'd be like, yeah, I'll take it. Not sure what the value of gold is right now, actually. I didn't check that out. I'm not sure if precious metals are up at all. I don't think they were. Are. Now people are buying gold, I believe. But in this game, we're not looking at the real world. We're looking at an enjoyable time and having fun digging ourselves a brand new cave system. <laughs> okay, I think I can crouch with C, right? Yeah. So we can dig a little deeper. There is a bigger shovel that we can utilize. <laughs> Boom. There is no inventory system. Some people ask me that all at the freaking time. No, no, no inventory system. Just the pure digness of digging and picking and dropping. And you know what? It is fun. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I'm not getting paid for these things. If I was getting paid for a game to play, and if there is ever offered to me, I will definitely advise you guys. And, and you know, I wouldn't say no to these troubled times, but it has to be something I really like. All right? If I like it, I will do it. But uh, even that, most of the time, I just buy it myself. I don't really, uh, you know, especially indie developers, I will never ask for a coin for them. It's very important. I think it's only once someone sent me some money for a game after the fact, after I completed. I end up doing it to the charities over here. And it wasn't because I didn't need the money, it was because it just didn't feel right. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying. And it feels like I'm forced to play the game. But yeah, as long as it's like, you know, something like that, it's fine. Two. But yeah, I would definitely mention it to y'all. Three. There we go. Drop you. Pick you up. Okay, one more shovel, and we're gonna find out how much gold we have if we're gonna be able to buy at least some stuff. All right, so I spent about five, six, seven, ten minutes. <laughs> it's been a while. I've been spending a little time off camera, just trying to get a little more nuggets going. And it looks like we're doing pretty good, so we can at least start off with a decent amount of nugs. All right, you know what? I found that the controllers are better when I'm picking up things. I don't know if it's just. I don't know. It seems a whole lot better. All right, let's pick up our fine bucket right over here and we're going to try and sell off every last bit of it now there is two different stores in there and there's only one right where you can sell off jewelry and stuff i don't believe you can sell off this stuff in there uh we got a pretty good amount though didn't we we got a pretty darn uh, good amount of doing this so we can press f1 and move this by the way this is a little bit annoying i'm gonna check out here i don't think we can sell it it's gotta be already kind of can't be like raw yeah i see it can't be raw in there by the way, the bucket's not included, so, you know, anything that we, we do here. All right, let's drop this. All right, if you get a little closer to it, look how it goes up. All right, $262. That is a good start. I'll take that. It's not fantastic, that's for sure. But you know what? Not the 20000 plus I've made off this thing. But everyone needs to start somewhere, and we're going to go on a little bit of buying spree and getting ourselves going. Uh, would like to build afford pipes and stuff. I know that it's not going to be a fact, and uh, it's not going to happen. I, I'm, I'm quite aware <laughs> it's not going to be. We can make this happen here. And we got a little bit of coin right there. We can drop this bucket right there because we're going to take the truck with it and move everything over. Uh, in case they got it, oh, it actually stacks all together now. Nice. I, if you do have like separate monies and you want to put them all together, you can drop them on the ground. They kind of fold it together. All right. So now we need to get ourselves uh, a little more production going. There's a pickaxe and stuff, which you can dig down a little deeper. These are expensive, right? Oh, jeez. Improved shovel. Uh, I'm going to need you. 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 Oh, crap. All right, so let's see. We have like 299 bucks, I think it was, right? So one f you. I need three. You need only five bucks each, right? Uh, wait a second before I do that. One of you. Okay, oh boy, I'm not sure if I can afford all this. How much is this at now? Oh my god, that's right on it. 
Okay, we're not going to put any foundations. I, I believe we can't afford any foundation. We have 2.99 bucks. Uh, this is going to give us just the right start for what we need. This is not the hammer to lay down things, right? This is what... This is a blacksmith hammer. Okay, I want to make sure there's two different kind of hammers. There's that hammer and there's another one. Where's the other one? I forget. Where'd the other one go? You can nail down things on the ground, and I believe it's around here somewhere. There it is. All right, so yeah, construction hammer. This will uh, nail down your wood pieces or anything you don't want to move. Uh, but this is a good start. Let's do this. I agree with it. I agree with it. Hopefully, it's uh, it's going to work out. We'll just place you there. Oh, crap. Oh, Lord. Okay, we'll just drop you down. Oh, okay, I took the truck. That works, too. All right, so everything is in here, and that took a little bit longer than I thought, back and forth. Not so bad. Uh, we're just going to drive the truck close to the edge over there. So we're going to build our stuff up. Oh, man, the truck's so much better. So much better. Okay, grab you. I believe I can do it on the road here for now. Yeah, I can place things. You see, you can place things like that. There you go. Uh, this one we don't want to place. Uh, this one we do want to place for now. Well, that anvil is going to be right in the ground, isn't it? Maybe it would be easier for it to topple over. <laughs> but for now, until we... Uh... You know what? Just, just pick this up and drop it. All right, so we're back, and here's a funny thing. I spent the whole night uh, literally digging and uh, trying to get, of course, some stuff. And now, these are the raw gems. I'm not sure if you guys can see them properly or not, but these are the raw gems right here. Look at that. If you can see, uh, see my bottom, my uncut ruby. If I press F1, it'll show up right there. Now, these are uncut. This means we need the grinding wheel to get that going. Uh, this one is an uncut emerald, as you guys can hopefully see properly. We'll pick them back up afterwards. Now, gold-wise, I dug pretty darn deep in there. And what I found is that gold is pretty much sporadically. you got big nuggets, small nuggets, depending where you're going to pick them up from. Uh, I even threw dirt on the side here just trying to dig a little deeper to see if it would be better down below. It seems like I can get more gems than anything else, and it's not a bad thing. They are worth a lot of money. We can make ourselves jewelry, which, uh, you know what, I don't hate at all. I do like this cutting. By the way, if you ever play this game and you get stuck and you see a little blue thing is touching that brush, it won't let you dump them, right? You got to make sure nothing's in front of you. Nothing, all right? <laughs> so, yeah, we're going to dig a, just a couple more. We're going to go back and uh, put this in there and uh, cook it up and make yourself something small, enough maybe to make yourself a little something uh, to sell off. We'll go and check out the markets and see what the best value is. Uh, but tell you the truth, what we're going to make, we'll probably just make a necklace one way or another and deal with it. All right, grab you, drop you down again. We'll just do this. We'll do this all night long. Try and find a better way. These are nothing. No gold in there. Yeah, it seems like the deeper I go, the less gold I find. I think that is a fact. Maybe just pockets of gold. See, look at that. No gold. All right, let's just test this out again i'm gonna go and dig over here on top because i need to dig up a little more it feels like gold is closer to the surface now they changed that up uh the developer itself and again this is an indie dev you guys are not aware but it is an indie dev so we'll do two more of these so you might change that up how things are working a tiny bit i do i really i do like the uncut gems on the other that is very cool all right pick that up Oh, I didn't want to do that. Okay, well, this is a regular bucket then. We're just going a little deeper. This is out of habit because I've been doing this all night long trying to grab some. Not that I didn't get any gold out of it, uh, but usually closer to the surface, I found a lot bigger nuggets than I did usually. Now, again, I don't have the good shovel for the deep. Yeah, look at that. That's nothing in there. That's not good. I mean, it's good, but gold's where many monies we're going to need. But I guess maybe gems are going to have to be your mainstay now. Yeah, look, I got a small itsy bitsy nugget, but I got a gem with that. Just a small little nugget. All right, let's try this out. One last test beforehand. And then dig the top part here. I don't know why I put that bucket so far. For fuck's sake. Stay away. Social distance your bucket. <laughs> the hell, Game Edge. Okay, that's four. Come close. Drop it. A little closer would be nice. Okay, one. And these are the top surface ones, right? So. Four. Okay. So we just do a double stack. And let's see what we get from this stack. So, so far, like literally five or six times, I didn't get very much gold. I only got it on the top. Yeah, you see, look at that gold is closer to its top than it was before. We got a lot of iron and stuff a little deeper. Uh, that's okay. That works out. Oh, sorry, dude. Hey, he's, he's, don't push it around too much. 
doesn't like it. Okay, one last jump and we're gonna go and dig out what we can. I guess I'll be doing a little work on the side too, because uh, at this point, no choice, right? Let's pick you up, drop you, and then brush you off. Yeah, I didn't get it much more. I don't, maybe it's bloody random dudes to do it. It's, it's possible. All right, let's grab our gold that we have here. Now, oh, I want to make a diamond, but I don't have the money for it. I'm just going to build a solo gold bar for there today. That's all there is going to be to it, right? I don't even have the mold. Hold on. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Come here for a second. I don't have a mold. I didn't buy a friggin' mold. <laughs> Bring my big bucket with me. That's right. So without the mold, I can't actually make the bricks. I can just heat it up and give them a soup. Some gold soup. Uh, not very good. <laughs> not very good. How much is this worth? 376 bucks. I, mean, I just need a bit of coin. Uh, 16. How about you? How much? 30 bucks a nugget. All right. Um, this little nugget here. Damn, the value is just dropping, dude. To do it. I should have checked how much the mold is. I'm going to grab $100 worth out of here. We'll bring that with us. Okay. There we go. 100 bucks. Thank you. It's not a lot, but I do like that it's harder than it was before. Uh, oh. Whoa. Okay. Maybe something to fix. I think I found an issue. Okay. Oh, wait. I got. I think I have to let it land. That's what it is. Just let it fall in there. I stopped moving. I think I can. Oh, uh, no. No. All right. So I dropped the money off. Came back and forth. You cannot drop it in this big, 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 big thing. <laughs> yeah, we can't do it. It, we're kind of screwed due to that. So, yeah, that's okay. But now we got a hundred and something bucks, 108 bucks in there, which is probably more enough to, for a mold, casting mold. Yep. I need that. Thank you. Perfect. To ching casting mold, that baby out. Uh, we have everything else here. The crucibles are here. We have a small furnace on that side. We should be okay. At least to make something out. How much is that freaking grinder, by the way? It's like a hundred and something bucks. I bet you it can't be cheap. I mean, I, I guarantee you it can't be cheap. 126 buckaroos. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm running kind of low. I'd love to see them with a diamond on it just to make a gem, but we'll do it next episode. That's all. I'll just dig at night and I'll get more gold anyways. It's not like we have a ton of it, so yeah. Let's just see how much we got from this sucker. Now you place it on here, you can see the gold. No, you can't burn yourself, thankfully. And on here, if I'm going to show it to you, if you would left click on it, you can see how much you can make yourself a... Uh, well, we can make a... Sh yeah, we could probably do that. Make yourself a sword or a dagger. So that's a dagger. These are two blocks here. You can make yourself a fine little uh, axe here, a machete, whatever you want to call it. And you got diamonds. You got yourself a necklace. So you got a kind of cool stuff here. Little rings and stuff we could sell. And this guy would be kind of like all done properly. Once it's melted, we'll drop that in there into the mold itself. I'm thinking I'm going to go hold on to the, the iron. The iron is the same process. You just drop it in here, make a mold, put it on top of there, and hit it with the pine hammer. This is taking a lot longer than I thought. Oh, there it is. Okay, I was about to stop and say, okay, this is not good. Okay, we need to drop you off with a blue one. All right, good stuff. All right, that is good. Okay, so we can grab this and see how much money we made today. I spent a lot longer than I thought on this. This is a little bit nutty. But again, if you guys want to see more of this, please take time, hit the like button, get in there, tell me, Game Edge, I want to see a whole lot more of this. I'm excited for it. I'm going to put a wish list. And I'll be working on the side trying to get ourselves a little more coin than 320 bucks. But $320 will get us that grinding that we need. And maybe a couple more buckets, which uh, I kind of desperately need too. So let's go and see what we're going to buy. Then I'll move things over on my own afterwards. All right, there we go. So I, I, whoop. I want that in there. And I'm going to want this grinding wheel. I do want some, of course, some stuff. Oh, no, I don't want to place it. Just drop it on there. That's $126. Uh, I'm going to need a couple more buckets like this and maybe a couple of views. So let's see here. One, two, three, and four. These are like a buck each. I should have bought one before. Jeez, I didn't realize they're that cheap. Yep, they're, they're like nothing. They don't wait any. They don't cost anything. No, 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 no. All right, how much money is that? 142 bucks. We have more than enough to get ourselves a couple of these in there. What is that on top? There's something else. Mining a helmet. Oh, my God.
God. We're so going to have to buy that. Okay, um, yeah, we're going to get a couple of these. Don't get sidetracked again, but you need to make your money first. Okay, did I just disappear? I think I just disappeared, dudes. <laughs> Throw it in there. How much we at? 157 bucks. Jeez, it's not that much money, is it? Well, in real life, sure, that's a lot. Oh, for freak's sake. Okay, we're going to do one at a time. Okay, so it's 100 and something bucks. I'll drop that off here. And put it down on the ground like this. Maybe not exactly there. Can I put it right over here? I can, and I can, can I put it there? No. So, best place is probably near that stupid rock. Still near that stupid rock. Okay, so we'll put that there. All right, I think I picked up the last little bit I can. How much money do I have left right now? I have 209 bucks still. Pretty darn decent. Uh, we could probably invest in a couple of pipes and stuff afterwards. These are pretty darn cheap. Maybe I'll get that going, and uh, we have enough of these. Now, I do need another crucible uh, so I can put the, and separate the, the stuff up that we do need, and I need another bucket. All right. Uh, that way, I'll at least I'll be able to put away the iron in here and then the gems in there. That'll make a big difference for me, at least for separating. Okay. Oh, crap. All right. Well, I pressed the wrong button there. Uh, Q, could jump in. I meant to press E. Let's jump over here and drop you off. Okay. Let's just do this final little measure here. Driving down the street, we got a little bit of stuff. This is how hard it is to start off your mining operation. It's a pain. It's a pain of fun, though. Okay, get out. All right, we're going to sleep the night, and then we'll be back in the morning. We'll start building this baby up. It's all right. We're also going to get too blade dark, and I won't see shite. Ah, just like that magically. Not hungry or anything. Beautiful. Can I turn you back on? I kind of like you on, dude. Don't go away. All right, it's all good. Um, so, yeah, let's build from there. Let's grab ourselves a couple of these with left click, bam. I didn't get a, a placing hammer, though. That is going to be important for us to go and get. We'll probably just get one of those before we finish this. Can I put it right there? Oh, that's sweet. With a little light, extra light next to us. It'll do for now. It will do. And uh, we'll grab this. Put that there. And where did my. Oh. Where did it go? Oh, my God. It got kicked all the way here. Did I drive by it and hit it? I might have hit it. I might have hit it. Okay. This can be my workstation for now. So we're going to rotate this with R. Beautiful. And actually, not so it doesn't fall on the other side. Let's just press this. And press R like that. Boom. Grab a hammer back here. Like that. And this one's going to go on this side down here. Still smoking hot, by the way. And you can't drop in the water. I think it just stops. If you just like, oh, no, it doesn't. It should have. Uh, so, yeah, this is it here. And I'm going to put the other pot there. We're going to get the hammer and solidify everything that we need to because we want them to start moving. Every time you start clicking around, you can grab it. This is the way to fix it. And pretty darn simple. 42 bucks. Damn, that's expensive, dude. But you know what? Luxury items are luxury items. You know just doesn't seem like one, but it sure is. <laughs> when you start playing this too much, yeah, it can be. All right, let's hit that. Hit that. Hit it once on and once to take off, all right? There we go. Beauty. Now, none of the stuff can be moved currently, which is very, very cool. I think I do something with mold here. Can I place the mold? I just drop it. Just, just drop there. Eh? Yeah, it's not letting me click it or anything. No. We just dropped the balls. We can move those anytime we want to. Not a problem. Okay. That being said, we got all the main stuff we needed for today. Not a bad day. We started off pretty darn good. We'll move our bed and uh, yeah, we'll just empty out the rest of this fine container back there. Oh, we still have the grinding stone. I forgot about the grinding stone. Right over here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we need to test that baby out. Let's do that right away. I almost forgot. Almost, almost, almost. We can't have an episode without it. At least be able to see it. Okay, come over here. We'll separate this up off camera. I'm just going to grab these gems and see what we got ourselves here. Okay, so we got an emerald here. Okay. How do I make this work, dude? Okay, so just left click it. Awesome. All right, chop you. Just for now, don't move. All right, so look at that. Nice cut gem. Beauty. Right there, we'll just drop it in the middle of the street because no one else lives in this damn town, so we're good. Okay, so left click. Oh, stand in front of it. Just like that. Bam. 
Got ourselves a nice little ruby right here. Ruby, ruby. And I guess we're going to need another bucket and stuff. Yeah, that's pretty darn simple. So yeah, we get the idea of it. Very, very nice. So I like that there's an extra process to this. It sounds crazy, but it is nice to have. Now this is what we're going to use to make jewelry. And uh, yeah, it's going to be pretty darn cool. We still have a lot of lead and stuff to kind of go through. Uh, but at least we can see the gems a little better. Boom! <laughs> I love it. So again, thank you for being here. Do appreciate it. If you guys like this, you want to see a whole lot more of this, please take time and hit the like button. If you're brand new, please go ahead and subscribe. You guys are the best. This game image, and I'll catch you guys on the flip side.